Hey everyone, Matt King with the King Piers team. Back out here on day 10 in Kansas City, Missouri. This is our four step full scope foundation repair project, as well as our uh, interior drainage uh, system that we're gonna be installing as well. Um, we have done the uh, straightening of the wall yesterday. So as you can see, we've used our combination of 90 degree angle iron, six by six true wood support posts, 30 ton bottle jacks, and we have tilted this wall back to vertical where it needs to be. Um, we're in the process now of getting our piers in place. Um, one thing I wanna point out also on this job, um, this is pretty much bedrock. And uh, we like to point out this one in particular because this house is proof that bedrock does sink. Um, so be cautious of that when you are uh, possibly dealing with other uh, foundation contractors that, um, that talk about putting their own piers to bedrock um, because that bedrock can sink. So we'll get this footing raised back up to its correct level elevation today. We'll start, uh, once that's done, we'll get the, uh, the walls prepped for uh, the crack repair. And then uh, on the outside, I believe we're also gonna try to uh, waterproof uh, with our uh, combination of epoxy, polyurethane, and commercial foundation tar on um, the outside of the wall before this weekend's rains. Um, Tuesday, we'll be back out here and we will, uh, Tuesday we'll be back out here and we'll start getting the uh, the crack repair wrapped up, start the, uh, the wall braces. Um, again, those braces, the bottom ends are gonna be right on the footing right there, concreted into place with high strength concrete. The upper ends are gonna be tied into the floor joists. Um, you'll see later on how we do our uh, wall brace installation. We're not gonna bolt anything from the bottom ends of the joist, it's all gonna be bolted from the side, engineering sound. Um, we are not here to, uh, to cause any damage to this house. And uh, unfortunately, we do see a lot of other uh, peering contractors, foundation contractors that do their wall braces bolting from the bottom. And uh, when you do that, you run the risk of uh, causing that joist to split down the road. So everything we do is uh, bolted from the side. Um, but yeah, once that's done, Interior should be pretty much wrapped up by Wednesday. And then we have our drainage system we're gonna be doing along the side here. So we'll get this all saw cut nice and neat, broken out, get our drainage in, and then we'll concrete that back in. We've got cracks here as well that we're gonna be uh, sealing. Um, you can see kind of the remnants of one of the previous attempts at uh, straightening the wall. Um, but again, using our King Pier methodology, you can see that we get that wall back where it needs to be. <laughs> because we say it every time, it's a lot easier to push against air than it is against earth. That's why there's so much prep time um, to get this wall ready to, uh, to push back. And you saw it in yesterday's video, in just about two, three minutes, this wall uh, was already vertical. So, um, we're, we're kind of in the home stretch here on this project, so stay tuned for more updates. You'll be able to find those again on our YouTube and Facebook channels. Just search for King Piers LLC if you have not visited before. Oh. You can also go to our website, kingpiers.com. And don't forget, you can always call us directly by phone at 1-816-288-4373.